Mike, <laughs> Mike, you don't need to tell everyone about how small your penis is. Like, that's... EMI, right? It's not eSports appropriate. <laughs> yeah, exactly. This is, this is eSports going on right now. You can't, you can't be talking about that. Feels it. <laughs> Round one. Fight! So, Chris is opting for the mirror this time? Yeah. Looks like he actually wants to uh, try and win this one. Uh, Mario doing a good job at the start. Keeping uh, Chris out. Chris obviously needs a little bit more practice at the boom war. Doesn't quite. He's back, really? Anyways. Um, I lost my train of thought. <laughs> Mario, or not, Chris making a really good comeback. But uh, I was saying, Chris seems to be a little bit out of practice because he's trying to negate Boon with the B skill, but he's uh, messing up the timing. Okay. Oh, I like that sweep behind the uh, the Sonic Cross. Yeah. Oh no, he's just jumping on it. Ooh, I love it. I only got a few seconds. Chris, what are you oh. doing? You have the life lead. <sighs> Round two. Yeah, Mario clutches it out. Chris doing a really good job at challenge. I guess they both do a really good job at challenging the uh, fake stuff. Because, you know, they would know. They know what's real and what's fake. They definitely know the characters. Like that standing M punch. So good. Is that a counter hit combo there? Um I maybe. <laughs> I don't know what you're talking about. I was, was still talking about I was still thinking about the standing heavy punch, but that wasn't a counter hit because it was like a crush. Like, those flash kicks. Flash so good. Too good. No, they they know the space. <laughs> oh my god! The relentless assault. Oh, Jesus. Final round. Upside down kick and upside down kick. That's the new tech. The Ubi flash kicks. They're there. Damn. That was the kind of surprise the flash kick thing came out of, out of Mario. There we go. Does light kick flash kick have throw invincibility? No. No? no. That's something I was on the same tool for recently. It's something that I was wondering, because I know that I like to wake up when I don't have any meter, I like to wake up with light punch CP because it covers both the throw and the upside down kick options. Yeah. That's it. I wasn't sure if Guile also had that choice. I kick a strike and reject them. Oh, okay. Good. Projectile and throw invincible. Oh, okay. So the Guile does have that option. I was just looking it up. Um, Guile's heavy kick 
As projectile and thrown men's abilities from frame 1 to 10. And also upper body invisibilities from one. one to four, so you have to right. you have to mediate properly, so it'll just get straight on through. Um... It might not beat the upside down kick though, because it has there's like a two frame window in there where it can get hit out of it. That's good to know. Oh, unfortunate. On that uh, Annie here. But not, yeah, no, not only does he get let out of the corner, but then Chris also takes tons of damage. All because he missed spaces and uh, missed time to splash kick by a little bit. He did not bless that flash kick. <laughs> Round two. Fight. Oh, he tried the flash kick. No flash kick answer back from Chris. I was I was expecting it. I thought Chris was gonna go for the you know, the revenge EX flash kick. Uh oh, he gets a yeah, gets a great jump in, chooses to activate. Really good corner Prize the shimmy. Oh no, Chris Prize the Annie but gets stuffed out. And he goes for the Ubi Flash Kick. Probably gonna cancel on the Super regardless, but Mario is sitting a little bit too far away, and that's gonna that's gonna do it for the game. Mario ties it up one apiece. Guile wins. Thinking. We're gonna be watching this for quite a while. <laughs> because if Chris resets the bracket, oh man. I don't know. I don't know. I, I think I need to pace myself. That or root for Mario. Loophole. Root for Mario. Alright, come on, Mario. Don't let Chris do it. <laughs> Yeah, that's that's what I like to see. Hit that upside down kick. The biased commentary. That's right. We got biased commentary from our biased TO. Fixes brackets. And I just, illusion is real. Illusion is real. There was that time where, um, like in between games, I had told I told a Ken like a better combo than the one he was doing and. He ended up winning because of, winning a game because of that damage difference. I'm the worst TO. <laughs> oh, Chris answers back with a perfect. That's right. You probably heard me like, oh, I'll show, I'll show Gami. I'm gonna make this last as long as possible. Good back throw out of Chris. Gets the corner control back. But Mario, not afraid to get Splash King. There's the revenge hey, there one. Yeah. Ooh, really good out of there. Another good anti here. Oh, goes for the throw bait. Mario not biting, but. Gets hit by the flame trap, and that's gonna do it. Chris, going up two to one. Is this commentator's curse? Commentator's curse. Guile right. wins. In the meantime, though, I'm gonna go grab another beer. So okay. I'll be right back.
two handed miss too much? <laughs> you basically just missed that for the most part. Maybe it's something. I was gonna try and be quicker, but as soon as I like got got downstairs, I saw that my cat was like legit just sleeping on the couch. I decided not to wake her up. I am running on by and slamming the refrigerator door or something. <laughs> Great walk up there out of Mario, but the rest just seems to have a read on everything Mario is doing right now. Oh, Mario drops his combo. The most disrespectful flash kicks. You can tell these two have played each other a lot. Yeah. I'm telling you, uh, and that's a bracket reset, so... Thank you, Chris. Win. I appreciate <laughs> it. Man, you, you had the commentator's curse there. You should thank yourself. Secretly, you wanted a reset. I know. Yeah, yeah you, know, you know, like, I just... It's go time. I just need more. I need more of this. I'm sorry. But he actually might play some soccer now. Oh, maybe we'll break out the cami. I want to see the cami. Let's do this. Please no. <laughs> <laughs> <sighs> I don't know I think what you you're the see. only person. I don't know. Ah, oh, it's it's got to get. Um, I don't know what you expect, Chansey. I don't know what you're expecting here. Mario seems to subscribe to the Kamikaze style matchup. Uh, like, uh, it works. It's so good. Eventually, if you play the same guy all enough, eventually they... Like, there's like three phases of, of doing jump-ins at the very beginning. Like, first, it always hits. Like, the first time you encounter a guy all, like, it's always gonna hit him. Then it start, Then they start going to, like, trying to predict whether or not you're gonna do it anymore. Right? And they start throwing booms sometimes, and then they start jumping again, and you get into this little mind game. So eventually, they just give up, and they just don't even try. It's like, I'm not... It's not worth the risk. Because they, they realize that if they get into that mind game, like a 50-50, does is he gonna do it, or is he gonna, like, you know... Like, kinda walk forward, press buttons, or whatever. Um... What is it? Like, like either they get an anti air for like a hundred whatever damage, or I get a full jumping combo, and it's like, you know, it's, it's not actually worth the risk of throwing that sonic boom. Yeah, you get your full, your full jump in, plus most likely you have the after. Oh, and they always take the throw after the jumping combo, too, so it's like, jumping combo, B skill, like, throw. Now they're in the corner at like 70 or 60 percent life. They're probably a little over half star or something like that. Yeah. And they're just demoralized. Guile win. So. I really like that corner combo. Oh yeah, I think it's so cool. Which is why I'm at, I'm really glad they gave uh, Ken. Like I wish more characters had like corner specific combos. You know? Like, yeah, I love right. Sakura's corner combos, I love that you can judge, you have to make a judgment call on whether or not you'll make it to the corner, to like, kind of maximize your damage. Yeah. Great sweep out of Chris there. Oh no, tries the anti or the crouch dab, but no good. Another, another flash break. We should have a counter for that next time. <laughs> oh, did you? Uh, I did this. Oh, 
a long time ago. Uh, back when Red Sea Fire was sponsoring Chris, uh, Chris Seeger, the combo breaker. I, I did a counter, along with the, uh, the combo breaker, you know, killer instinct. That oh sound every time so an EX, uh, yeah, the, the sound is really good. But every time an EX reversal hits, I donated a dollar to, uh, to Chris Gellin. It was great. That's awesome. I wish I was around for this. Ooh. Good use of that meter right there. Able to close out that round. Round two. Like, I know that, like, as for criticisms of the commentary right now, <laughs> what's going on is that I'm pacing myself because of, uh, you know, what's going on here. I knew it was going to be literally, like, what is it? First one's four games, so like ten games of of this. Of like seventy second rounds. Gotta pace myself. Oh, throw in that flash kick. Surprise no flash kick uh, on the jumper. I figured an EX. Oh, he didn't have EX. Okay. I guess he could have gotten away with the heavy one. That's that's protect element. Then you're risking getting your jump and stuff. All right. I, I see why he didn't do that. All right, corner pressure. How is uh, Mario gonna handle this? Ooh, was that a flash kick? No, I think that was a. That's the reversal. Guy oh, I see. win. I think. It, I could be wrong. No, I think I'm wrong in that. It can't be a. It can't be a mess up uh, V reversal because it wasn't an exotic boom. I don't know what that was. Press something. Round one. Fight. <laughs> This is potentially the last game on, um, well, Shoutcast. Oh, gonna curse it again. <laughs> Shoutcast. Alright, Chris goes for the jumping, but great anti-air out of Mario DB as he, uh, continues to keep the skies protected, not letting Chris get away with even a neutral jump. That time, though, Mario, with a badly placed, uh, side of cross, lets Chris get it, finds himself nearly at the corner, but not deterred as he starts that Sonic Boom game right back up. Even with his back in the corner. Chris, though, starting to regain control a little bit of the Spoon War. As uh, Mario, I don't know, just kind of sits there. I'm not sure what he's going for, though, but oh! Chris not buying that upside down kick as we find ourselves with a pretty even life lead, and they're just going back and forth. This time it's Chris with the anti air. But oh no! Mario gets the V-Trigger activation, and that's going to be really close to doing it. No, drops combo, and then the Flash Kick gets stuffed out by the Mini Sonic Boom. Chris is in trouble. He's got a huge life deficit. Could get chipped out at any point. Only 20 seconds left to go. I'm not sure if he's going to be able to make this comeback, and no. Anti-air trades. Anti-air trades, but hey, that trade is great in favor of Mario. Chris... Trying to regain control of the screen with the X Sonic Boom, but does it way too late. Then somehow catches Mario with a second hit of a sweep. What is this silver scrub level? <laughs> That's not something you'll see in a, in silver as a anti air flash kicks. Well, maybe you will. I don't actually know. It's been too long since I've been there. Anymore. Chris, with uh, some really good pressure, catches Mario trying to walk back. He goes right back into that Sonic Boom War, but Mario getting a read on the pattern. Gets a jump and gets corner control and the throw. Going for those block strings, and then the reversal super because Mario was throwing just too many Sonic Booms. 
godlike. And then they just reactivate in each other's faces for some reason. No, no. Chris having a lot of trouble though. He's just gonna get shipped out right now. He done. He can't really. Uh, can't really respond. But there it is with the jump in. Jansen with the EX Sonic boom. He's almost made this comeback. All right, what's it gonna be? Oh wow, Mario playing very patient. I think he's Mario tapping with the Sonic Boom War just to try and time this one out because he's got a life lead as little as it is and he closes it out. Chris, making me watch more of this matchup. <laughs> Commentator Chris is real. Problem with the shout casting with the enough for like you're you're a few seconds behind me, right? Uh, yeah, I'm a little behind you. Yeah, that's Round that's the problem with the shout casting is that you can't, it stifles your ability to, to really say anything. Not trying to do the conversation. That was a great flash kick though. Going right back and not afraid. It's not as impressive now that I know that it's projectile and into great one. I thought it was like Ken, where it was, uh, what was it? Projectile and Vince from like Spike 3 or something like that. You had to be like really on top of your spacing and your gaps or whatever, but no, he, he, he just gets it for free. <laughs> so it's not nearly as impressive for me anymore. Oh, great jump in. That's gonna do it. Chris, going up to match point or tournament point. Round two. Sometimes they do uh, do a guile tru uh, truce and you go uh, Sakura versus Karen. That happens a few every once in a while. But I think part of me is thinking uh, with Evo coming up that they might. Uh, they might actually want to give you a Yeah. And this is a matchup that they're going to have to play. So, I get it. Especially in a setting like this where like it's long set where they're trying to, you know, they have first to three. So this is their third first to three, so that's like Really good practice in terms of like adjustments and such to what other guys are doing. So I totally get both of them, you know, taking this, you know, like actually going for it. Great flash game there. Chris getting a little bit too ahead of himself. himself. Oh man, Chris goes for the jump. Oh, yeah, it was, he goes for the jump in that would have stuffed out a flash kick if Mario did it at the normal time. But Mario waited. Yeah. He knew. It's an interesting thing. Like for Chotos or whatever the cross cut is, this backwards input. But for charge characters, you just have to delay it for a while. Yeah. Which I think could even be harder. Um, yeah. Not sure. I don't, I'm not good enough at charging. For the the Shotos, it's there's two ways to do it. You can do quarter circle forward, quarter circle back, or you can actually do just like a half circle back. So you just have to know that it's coming. Oh, pass him upside down, kick, oh. and that's it. Those situations where Chris is just moving forward a lot seem to have Mario DB in a bit of a stump. Yeah, it's um, what it, what's going on is that when Mario is standing his ground, it's much more even. But when mm -hmm. but when he's when he gets afraid and he starts trying to back off, Chris knows like he just knows how to chase that guy down and murder him for trying to run away. That I think that happened every single time that Mario tried to back off. And with that. Finally one. Yeah, good job, Chris. Good job. GG's. With that, that is a, um... Yeah, it was a... It was, despite all the crap that I was saying, it was a really interesting match. I did, I did actually enjoy that. Dude, I'm gonna have a death grip on my stick. Yeah. <laughs> 
I would say that I'm I was gonna sleep nude, but that wouldn't stop Mike. Uh, you going to Evo? Me? Yeah. Yes, sir. Nice. I'll see you there then. Maybe just miss some stuff. <laughs> <laughs> oh, if you are actually looking to learn and learn stuff like that, I do. Um, you see me do replay reviews. Yeah, Remember? yeah, yeah, yeah. Just ask. Do it. Want, I want people to be better at this game. Especially <laughs> Ken's. want to be better. Especially Ken's. We need to show the world that Ken is top one. Oh yeah, I'm going I'm going to Evo Chris. Yeah, I'll see you there. We'll get some we'll get some offline sets and it'll be awesome. Yeah, so many people. This is actually it's actually the first major that I'm going to ever, so. A lot of a lot of people like that I see online on streams and stuff that I have to meet gonna be um gonna be good and then obviously i'm gonna make top eight so you know i'm gonna have a, a busy a busy schedule <laughs> um i do have a little bit of a question for the the week of evo yeah um is the tournament gonna be hosted by someone else or is it just not gonna be happening um it's like since you're not gonna be here so normally when i'm not here i have Kirby run the tournament. Mm -hmm. He does a really good job running the tournament. Um, I think the tournament is just not going to happen. Not necessarily because I don't think Kirby wouldn't do it. I don't think he's going. He's going to Evo, then that's, that's just it. But yeah. it's just... I think too many people will be at Evo and watching Evo. Yeah, like, I normally run, like, right now it's defending. It's like four, four tournaments going on right now. I'll still run it because, you know, it's a lot of fun, but... Yeah, for sure. Yeah. I just wanted to ask to be sure. Uh, I'll make it. I should make an announcement. Uh, Evo is not next week. It's the week after next week. Two weeks, right? Yeah. Yeah, okay. So there's still going to be a tournament um, tournament next week. Um, probably. Yes. Yeah, I'm not doing anything. Okay. Um, with that, it's Mirkelu, who thank you for, for joining me and co commentating. Uh, Thank you really for having great. me. Yeah, and if you want to, like, as often as you want to come and join co-commentate, welcome. Um, um, I'll definitely try to be here as much as I can. Okay, because I don't know, like, some, like I know Kirby, like Kirby, kind of liked it too, but then he's like, well, he want, he'd rather play though, so mm -hmm. don't wanna, don't wanna make you feel bad for wanting to play. All right. Um, with that, I'm Kamikaze Warrior. We run this West Coast, it's West, four West Coast in Central America, US, and you know, Canada, Mexico, whatever. Every Friday night at 7 p.m. Pacific. If you're East Coast, you can play in the East Coast tournament that's, that's on Mondays, run by the Joe Monday. That's at 8 Eastern. Who won? Chris won, obviously. Kirby, come on. Don't come in, don't come in here and start talking, saying stupid shit, like, <laughs> Jesus. Um, and then if you enjoy the, my stream, my casting, I play a lot of Street Fighter, uh, Ken, obviously, I stream, um, I stream four days a week now, it's Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, uh, Thursdays, and Friday for this tournament, so, uh, come check that out. Um, so with that, thanks for hanging out, and I will see you guys later. Peace. GG's, everyone. GG's.